Let's see how it goes. Okay. Who do you want to go? Who, who should go first? Should we ask each other one question, Joey? No, I think we've both got to ask each other the same question. Okay. okay, I'll ask first thing. Given the choice of, an, of anyone in the world, who would you want as a dinner guest? Jim Morrison. Why? Because he's fit. That's literally <laughs> the only thing like. Shallow. That is shallow, isn't it? No, because I like him. Okay, you can answer the same question. Yeah. Okay. Given the choice of anyone in the world, who would you want as a dinner guest? Um, Alexander the Great. Why? Uh, I just I think he'd probably be quite interesting. Because he's great. Yeah, exactly. This is it. Okay. Uh, would you like to be famous? Um, in what way? No, I would not like to be famous. Why? I don't think I'd like the attention. I think I'd love the attention. Okay. Uh, before making a telephone call, do you ever rehearse what you're going to say and why do you, if you don't? Only if it's an important telephone call from which I need to get information from the person I'm doing it, then I wouldn't like, rehearse it, but I plan what I was going to say to them. What, like? Like, so to the council or something? Yeah, something important like that. Before making a telephone call, do you ever rehearse what you're going to say? Sometimes, especially if I'm angry about something as well. Oh yeah! I'll definitely like plan out what I'm going to say, like the, the key points of the argument. Okay. Yeah. See, I don't do that. I do. I should do that. Yeah. You always win arguments. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what would constitute a perfect day for you? Being sunny, the weather is a big part of my mood. Yeah. What would constitute to choose a perfect day for you? Um, I think the opposite. I, I think staying in with like really like heavy rain. Yeah, that's quite weird, isn't it? No. Like really bad. <laughs> um, when did you last sing to yourself or to someone else? I sing to myself all the time. Have you got a good voice? No. <laughs> <laughs> When was the last time you sang to guitar? Uh, yesterday. Why? Because uh, I'm learning to play the guitar and well, it sounds so really like. Mm, kind of, yeah. It's hard to play the guitar and sing at the same time. I agree. Mm. <laughs> uh, if you are able to live up to the age of 90 and retain the, uh, the mind or the body of a 30 year old for the last 60 years of your life, which would you want? I wouldn't want my mind to not develop. Yeah, but then you might end up like with dementia. But well, you might end up with dementia anyway. It's oh, true. You can get it. You can get it. Yeah, yeah. This is true. Um, the same question to you. I would probably keep my mind, like, my mind in the mind of a thirty-year-old, but sharp. Sharp. Yeah, I'd rather be. You're bound to get more like a 90 year old isn't as sharp as a 30 year old, isn't it? No. <clears throat> but then you'd be like sort of physically old but trapped with a really young man. I guess so. But then if you were really old and had like dementia, it wouldn't matter if you had like a really young body because you'd just be kind of confused at everything. That's true. Um, do you have a secret hunch about how you die? No. You don't? No, I don't. I don't want to either. <laughs> <laughs> do you have a secret hunch about how you die? Uh, I think maybe I'll be cycling when I get removed. Oh, really? Yeah. Do you be specific? Not, not, not any time soon. Have you dreamed about it? Yeah, I think so. I was drunk oh. at the time as well. Okay. Like while I'm cycling. 
energy. Yeah. Right. So maybe when I'm like an old man, so I can get a bike somewhere. Okay. Yeah. Right. Um, name three things you and your, me and you have in common. Both were the same school. Yeah. We're the same age. Yeah. Both wearing jeans. Well done. <laughs> How about you? Uh, we both have. Mm, just step both do the same subject. Do. Both quite edgy, basically. Both edgy, yes, it is. Um, and. Both stuck for work. That's true. Yeah. Hence this. Right. Um, for what in do you, your life do you feel most grateful? Um, having a really supportive family. That's a good one. And something to fall back on. Yeah. Uh, I'd say the same. Yeah, There's another thing we've got in common. There you go. Um, if you could change anything about the way you were raised, what would it be? Oh. Deep. Okay, let me change anything about the way I was raised. I would have prepared it, preferred it if our parents didn't split up. So. Yeah. So, definitely. I think. Yeah. Tell me your life story in four minutes, in as much detail as possible. Um, life story, right. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, I was born and, and then I went to school. <laughs> I was born and then I was. <laughs> and then that's it. And then, um, I don't know what you want to know. My parents split up but they got back together. Mm -hmm. um, and then... What age? I don't remember, I think I was like 15, 14, 15, maybe. Um, and then I left school, and then I went, and then I'm now going to school again. That's all I'm telling you. Tell me your life story for me, please. Uh, I was born, I moved to several different countries, went to school. Uh, <laughs> Worked with council in the military defence, tried to join the forces, didn't, and came to uni. Okay. Yeah. Um, cool. If you could wake up tomorrow and gain any one quality or ability, what would it be? This includes like superpowers, I assume. Oh, and I'm, I'm going to think of a superpower, I don't know. Any quality or ability, what would it be? To be invisible. What, uh, just all the time? No, no, just like be able to be invisible when I'm going to be invisible. Yeah, that's quite good. Yeah, what about you? I'd be able to teleport. Oh. Definitely. So you could just go like, to like... Wherever you want. Yeah, to the dentist for a coffee. Oh, that'd be good. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, if a crystal ball could tell you the truth about yourself, your life, the future, or anything else, what do you want to know? Shit. What, wait, wait, what I'm supposed to do and whether I'm doing the right thing. Yeah, that's a good one. That's it. Yeah. What about you? Uh, I don't usually look at this, but it's hard to be true. <laughs> <laughs> I want to. Uh, mm. No, if I'm going to be rich or not. Why? I'm just interested, I'm curious. I have a feeling I'm going to be. Hmm. I just want to know that. I want to like know what I was going, to, what I was like put here to do because I think it might be like. Feel as if you didn't do it that you have accomplished it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Is there something that you've dreamed of doing for a long time? And if so, why haven't you done it?
Nothing. No. Really? Not even like skydiving or something like that? No. Mm -hmm. uh, um, what about visiting anywhere? Yeah, I would like to go a few places. I'd like to go to 